Welcome to the CompuAir Workbench Installation Considerations Module. Here you will learn about how the installation of this product relates to other CompuAir products and its overall importance to Workbench users. The formal description of the CompuAir Workbench, an open development environment to boost programmer productivity and enable the next generation mainframe programmer, may not be clear to the installer. If we simply say that users will perform common mainframe IT tasks within the workbench, that does not fully convey the importance of this product for those who will be using it. Let's have a closer look at how the users will benefit from the workbench. First time users will see this welcome screen when launching the workbench and numerous options will be available. Common ZOS ISPF functions, intelligent source code editing, and job submission and review may be done under the Host Explorer. The functionality with the Host Explorer includes allocation and deletion of datasets, recall of migrated datasets, and manipulation of PDS members. Interactive debugging may be done using Expediter Eclipse. Data browsing and editing, including DB2 and vSAM, may be done using the FileAid Data Editor. Transaction logging and analysis may be done with HyperStation. Performance analysis may be done with iStrobe. And finally, fault diagnosis may be done with Abendade. Let's add some perspective here. The user view of the mainframe includes Abendade, the FileAid group, the two expediters, HyperStation, and Strobe. The installer view of the mainframe is larger and includes everything in the user view plus CompuWare shared services, host communication interface, and FileAid common components. And it's these last three that ensure that the workbench is working properly. At this point, we will outline the CompuWare Workbench installation. Under all circumstances, CompuWare Shared Services and Host Communication Interface must be up to date. CompuWare Shared Services, or CSS, essentially consists of components shared by multiple CompuWare products. Host Communication Interface, or HCI, allows CompuWare products running on various platforms to access the mainframe. If you are implementing Expediter Eclipse for either batch or CICS programs, ensure that the required versions of Expediter TSO and or Expediter CICS are installed. These steps may also require some tailoring such as implementing the Expediter TSO multi-batch facility or creating a specific Eclipse logon proc. If you are implementing FileAid Data Editor Access, you will likely have to install FileAid Common Components. This is the interface between the FileAid Data Editor here on the workbench and the FileAid products running on the mainframe. Additionally, FileAid MVS and or FileAid for DB2 must be checked for currency as well. If you are implementing HyperStation, ensure that the required version is installed. If you are implementing iStrobe under the workbench, ensure that the required version is installed. If you are implementing Abinade under the workbench, ensure that the required version is installed. If you haven't already done so, you will need to implement the Abendade web browser interface. Finally, install and test the workbench, then plan the deployment. To summarize the CompuWare workbench installation, verify the currency and maintenance on relative CompuWare products, Tailor the back office CompuWare products as necessary. Build and test the HCI configuration. 
optionally set up HCI as a started task, and finally, plan the workbench desktop rollout. All of the workbench installation requirement details are available in publications that can be found on Frontline. This concludes this module. Thank you.